Alright everybody, hello, it's the Zodiac. I'm sorry about today, it is sweating hot in the UK and I can't help it, so get that out of the way first. Yes, we've got the brand new trailer, da -da -da -da. 3 point. Oh yes, it's just around the corner now. Probably another two weeks, probably something like that. But yes, we finally got the trailer thanks to a new special program that just released a few hours ago on the live stream. But I haven't spoiled myself and I'm actually going to watch the trailer first and go straight into the juicy bit. And then I'll nitpick on the little details in that time. But this is going to be a hype on trailer, trust me about it. But yes, uh, the trailer is going to be called The Morn of a Thousand Roses Brings. If that's sad right, if that's how the trailer goes. But yes, Hoyaverse. This is a big hype because it's huge, this trailer. Roughly... Six minutes long? Frickin' hell, I was expecting five! Well, apparently, it's huge content! And we're getting Sumeru! Yeah! So, let's get on with this then, shall we? Let's! Have you heard of Ermin's soul before? Oh, Ooh, the Dinjo tree. Archon is known as the God of Wisdom yeah, because her consciousness is directly connected to Oh, so a brain hive. To the people of Sumeru, she's not only a symbol of wisdom, but also of power and kindness. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, she disappeared in a great calamity a few hundred years yeah, ago. Yeah, knew about that. The sages later found the newly born Dendro Archon and whisked her back to Sumeru. It's Lesser Lord Kusanelli's birthday. Oh, it's a birthday the festival. All right. Zeros is about to begin. The most important performance at the Subzeros Festival. The goddess of flowers began to dance. Countless beautiful Padisaras began to bloom wherever she stepped. Oh god, Subaru! Yes! Though we're just oh, this is a big mess of giant. To the divine, we still have to do our best to make sure that the birthday girl feels loved on her special day. Uh, special day is probably gonna get ruined. The stage is going to be even prettier when it's festival time. I can't wait for you to see it. Oh, it looks so gorgeous. Environments, new locations. Holly! First news character to start off with. Boom! What the hell? Did you do an amber trick? It's been recorded in Sumeru for millennia. It's said that it originates from the depths of the world. I'm afraid we rangers will be battling the wind. Oh, it's Technari's voice. Many plants in the rainforest are already in decline. Oh, he's a bow user! Sweet! Oh, there we go. It's confirmed. Oh, he uses bombs! Ah! Sneaky Hoyoverse. Making us think it's a catalyst. It's called an Akasha Terminal. It's a tool produced by the Academia. The Traveler gets to use it! It utilizes the legacy of Greater Sweet. Lord Zuka. Dendro Traveler! You may use an Akasha <laughs> terminal to connect directly to the Akasha and access any knowledge you need. Okay. The Divine Knowledge Capsule should be up for a secret auction within the next few days. Use it, and you'll gain the wisdom oh, of the Oh, I can sense of Fatui messing up this. I need you to find someone, a traveling merchant. Oh, Dory! Ooh. Oh, she's the Claymore user. Right. New domains, new world bosses. Oh, new one guards and such. You all saw that just now? The Grand Sage ordered us to stop the Oh no. Something's gonna go Maybe wrong. Maybe they see Lesser Lord Cusinelli's birth as confirmation of Greater Lord Rukadabata's death. Aren't you ashamed of pursuing such frivolous and meaningless hmm? activities in this land of knowledge and reason? This device, it's extracting energy from the ley line. It looks like he used the Divine Knowledge Capsule. Ooh. The sub Zeru's Festival. Boss? Go celebrate the birth of that god. What's happening? Did Tori? What the hell is he doing? Our Archon created the utopia that is Sumeru City for all scholars who sought validity, verity, and truth, while people like you wish to defile it. Oh, he's even wearing a crown. It's risky to continue the Subzeros Festival. <gasps> I don't want to get everyone in trouble. <laughs> Giant moves! We don't have any more festivals to waste. Are you really so 
Oh no, not about this old lord again. Is that the tree that actually gets burnt? The world forgets. The morn of a thousand roses brings. Oh, oh, here we go, the new events, the camera event, okay. Taking out the new wildlife, taking the advantage of a new region. That's good, smart going there, holy verse. Okay. Different kinds of challenges because of a new region, so new events. Following coins, doing boss battles, taking pictures. Taking the sights. Okay. Raven in innocence? Or Graven innocence? Alright, let's keep going. Uh, let's see. Tablet. Analysis. Analytics? Hmm. Oh, is it some kind of battle arena? Okay. Well, obviously, this is the reason why this trailer is so long. It's got all the extra stuff in the stream. Lost riches. Obvious. We need essential materials and such to grind. In the wilderness of Sumeru. Phase trials. Ooh! So it's like another version of a photo form, but a bit different. And of course, ley lines. Oh, new artifacts, of course, new domains and such. Oh, and there's the new weapons! Oh, and the new recipe ones! Ooh. Beast! Hold your verse! Oh, oh. your verse, you just blew my brains for this one. Jeez, yes! I'm getting a lot out of this. On a free game, oh, the story's gonna be brilliant. Obviously, we knew about the birthday for the new Archon for Nendro and Sumeru. That's supposed to be a birthday festival that gets interrupted. That's what it sounds like. Something goes wrong. That's no big brainer for that because they've already did that in Leeway and all the other nations. So, for two years, they obviously ended up with something. We get new recipes, new characters. New locations, new chests, new puzzles, new monsters, beasts, artifacts. There's probably a few more. And a story, and of course. Who doesn't want a good story? But personally to me, there's so much there I really want to sink my teeth into because that looks good. Because all that content, oh, everyone's going to be going for it crazy. Because... I've been on this game for the past two years and it is beautiful. You can't say no to a free game that is beautiful like this and it's been gone for two years. So yeah, there you go. There is Hoyoverse for Genshin Impact version 3.0 The Morn of a Thousand Roses Bean trailer that was just announced today. So, give me your thoughts down below. Do you think this was a good trailer? Could they've been a bit more added into it? But yeah, leave a comment, subscribe. You know the works, you know the drill. I hope you enjoy this video, everybody. And I hope to see you around then. Peace.